Hey sis, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Susie. If you're new, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. If you're returning, what's good, what's poppin'? Sis, we're gonna make this dress. Let's get into it, y'all. I do a bunch of DIYs and I like to get straight to the point over here. So y'all, I got my fabric. I went to the fabric store, my favorite fabric store. And right here I am showing y'all, I already had went ahead and cut out my um, template using other fabrics. If you're new over here, I like to use um, pieces of clothing that I already have to create stuff um, but I am going to get into patterns really soon but as of right now this is the way that I do it so I can save a little money so right here is what I'm doing is cutting out the front part of the dress this is for um, my client she actually in high school and she was wearing this for her homecoming they had a Hollywood theme so we was going for something sparkly bright and she was she wanted feathers so we added feathers as well so right now i am hemming the two pieces of the front panels together and i am sewing those two together because this is high school so they don't want of course transparent um see-through mesh so i am sewing the two front pieces together yeah, I am slowly but surely trying to get back to work after everything. <sighs> oh, excuse me, that's been going on. And it actually feels really good to start back working. Um, so now what I am doing is just look over the dress. And we are going to go ahead and start with the sleeve. So this was some extra fabric that I had left over. Just literally just enough for the sleeve. Um, so I am folding it in half, right sides together. Look at Polo, y'all. Him sleeping. But I use this little shirt right here, and I am cutting the sleeve way longer than the sleeve that you see because I just wanted to make sure it was long enough for when she came and tried it on. We're gonna put the sleeves to the side and we're gonna start on the back panel so we can go ahead and add the zipper um i went ahead and measured it out and marked it at the end of the dress y'all yeah, my table wasn't long well it is long enough but i had my camera zoomed in too far so y'all couldn't see the full thing but y'all see enough that y'all need so um we're just gonna go ahead and cut down to the length that we need and go from there i'm gonna go ahead and pin it down y'all i've been posting vlogs every friday well trying to um but i've been doing good so far so and i see that y'all been liking those and i'm excited about it so right now y'all we're gonna go ahead and i didn't get in detail on the zipper because i showed y'all how to do zippers if y'all want another video then let me know i can give y'all a personal video on that but right now, we're just going to go ahead and attach the top of the dress together. Y'all, please excuse me for keep yarning. It is currently 10 o'clock. Well, 11 o'clock at night. And I am trying to finish up my vlog. I mean, finish up my videos for the week and do some scheduling. So, y'all, now we're going to go ahead and add the sleeves. So, literally, you're going to... Um, put the right sides together, pin it, and then we're going to sew it. I'm going to uh, um, show y'all exactly what I'm doing. Y'all know I like to go step for step for y'all for know what's going on. So basically we did that and we are sewing around the sleeve like so. y'all so now we got that all out the way this is what it should look like and we're going to go ahead and take the sleeve and sew straight down that and also the rest of the dress so sis while we do that go ahead and leave me a nice little message down below because i definitely needed something very encouraging and i would really appreciate it and i just wanted to tell y'all that i love y'all so much because i'm seeing so much progress in my channel and 
it's like i'm just trying to give y'all these nice little videos but y'all um right here i'm turning the dress inside out when she came and tried it on like this it was so freaking cute but she wanted her feathers so we ended up adding feathers at the bottom of the dress which was super cute the ones we had at first she didn't want those because they wasn't as fluffy so um we made it happen okay so i ordered them off of amazon and if y'all need them i will list them down below in the description box but i went ahead and made this extra panel and i'm just right now i'm just sewing it on and then after that i am going to um attach the feathers i didn't get super super detail in the feathers but i'm going to explain to y'all what i did so i just wrapped the feathers around the dress and i pinned it to where i wanted it and after i did that i like kind of sewed it down and i'm going to try to show you but it's not going to be as detailed but if you just can follow on with what i'm saying then you can definitely do it but if y'all want another video on how to do the feathers i will give y'all a video so let me know but i really hope y'all enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful and i hope y'all try it out um make sure y'all shop Susie collection dm me for custom orders and this is the final and finishing look i love you guys oh so much give this video a big thumbs up y'all she was so cute Aww. but i love you guys bye peace